Hi, welcome in. Let's go to God's word. Then Jesus said to his disciples, Therefore I tell you, do not worry about your life, what you will eat, or about your body, what you will wear. Life is more than food, and the body more than clothes. Consider the ravens. They do not sow or reap. They have no storeroom or barn, yet God feeds them. And how much more valuable you are than birds. Who of you by worrying can add a single hour to his life? Since you cannot do this very little thing, why do you worry about the rest? Luke 12, verses 22 to 26. Now to him who is able to do immeasurably more than all we ask or imagine, according to his power that is at work within us, to him be glory in the church and in Christ Jesus throughout all generations forever and ever. Amen. Ephesians 3 verses 20 to 21. Anxiety is a result of envisioning the future without me. So the best defense against worry is staying in communication with me. When you turn your thoughts toward me, you can think much more positively. Remember to listen as well as to speak, making your thoughts a dialogue with me. If you must consider upcoming events, follow these rules. 1. Do not linger in the future, because anxieties sprout up like mushrooms when you wander there. 2. Remember the promise of my continual presence. Include me in any imagine. pardon me, include me in any imagery that comes to mind. This mental discipline does not come easily because you are accustomed to being God of your fantasies. However, the reality of my presence with you now and forevermore outshines any fantasy you could ever imagine.